So today we're going to review my GE 23.62 inch 58 decibel portable dishwasher that we got because we live in an apartment and we hate washing dishes. So this thing right now is listed at $749 Canadian, but we got it for I think $499 Canadian. It's got a lot of room for dishes. And I think the main reason we got it was because it was the same height as this counter. We got it in white because that's all that was in stock, but I don't think that was our ideal color. And I guess now I'll show you how to set it up with a whole bunch of dirty dishes and show you how clean they come out. So we gotta wheel this thing all the way out to here. And then from the back, we've got our electrical plug, which we'll plug in wherever we can. Then we've got our water hose. You just pull out, kind of drips sometimes because never really, you know, you never really fully get the water out. And we'll bring it to our sink, which has this special tap on it. This special attachment so it can click in. So you have to remove whatever you have. I had to remove this tamper safe one by tampering with it. So that was pretty easy. I just used pliers, put them there and unscrewed that because we're not supposed to have them here. So first you turn on the hot water, make sure it's really hot. And then you pull this thing down. So it clamps in place and then you just turn it on and nothing leaks, see, it's good. And there's this little red button here, that's your bleed, but you don't need that till the very end. So from the front here, we use Cascade, because that's what it came with, and I figured that would work just fine. Throw one of these in here, and make sure there's nothing big here that's gonna block this from opening up halfway through the cycle. I don't use this, which is like, to make your glasses nicer or whatever. And then as for modes, we have heavy, auto sense, and light. Light is 48 minutes, heavy is 209 minutes, auto sense 166 minutes. I've been using light every time, and it always works. Don't use my wash time and I don't use my delay start. Then I'll just click here. This is solid, so it'll start when I close it. Oh, why did it beep? There, you heard the clicks. And it's going to start sucking in water right away. So now it's uh, just gonna run its cycle. Just push out old water that's in there and stuff. And in 48 minutes, it'll beep and it'll be done. Meanwhile, the whole time, it's gonna pour water out through here. So we'll be back in 48 minutes to see how well it worked out. Okay, I'm standing like a few feet away and I feel like you can still hear me just fine. You can definitely watch TV while this thing is running. And I don't think any of your neighbors will know that you have one if it's running. The ground isn't vibrating weird or anything, so. Spitting some dirty water out. Okay, it finished its cycle. It did the little song. Doot, 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 doot. But I missed it, so if we open it up. Ooh, steamy. See, everything's nice and clean. Well, I guess maybe not everything, but I can't explain that. Generally, everything is pretty clean. There's probably the coffee grinds from this thing. And to unplug it, what we do is we turn the tap off, bleed it, then we can unhook that and Water never fully comes out. But then we go around to the other side and then we'll slide this right back in and then we'll unplug it and feed that back in and wheel it back to where it was. And now it blends in with the rest of our furniture. 
let it dry a bit. And uh, yeah, plates come out clean. No issues. That's pretty much everything with this LG dishwasher review. Highly recommend it. I hate washing dishes and this has been a lifesaver. So 10 out of 10. Would have paid full price for it.